Rogers, N.D., owner of Northwest Neurocranial Medicine, LLC, in both Snohomish, Washington and Bozeman, Montana. I'm here today with Ted Neff to talk about the MRS-2000 and how we're using it in our daily practice. Ted? I am the owner of Edmonds Wellness and Revolution Sports Medicine in Edmonds, Washington, which is right outside Seattle. And we utilize this obviously for illness and disease and for sports injuries. Okay, so can you tell us what actually the MRS-2000 is doing? Okay. Well, it's considered a pulsed energy device and the scientific name is Pulsed Electromagnetic Field Therapy or Device. And what this does, it assists the body to heal and repair itself. Okay. Are there magnets in this? No. There's uh, sets of coils in the mat and the pad and when you run electricity through a coil, uh, you get a magnetic field from that. And so the, this technology pulses it so it's not constant. And a magnet, on the other hand, is a constant, or it's called a static field. And research has shown that if you pulse it, you get a much, much greater therapeutic value if you do that. So what is pull the pulsing you're talking about? Why is that important to us as humans? Well, we evolved from pulsing energy from the Earth, and the, we, we know from, from research that the Earth's field has been reduced up to 50 percent. Uh, not sure how long that took place, I mean, 200 years, 300 years, but it's much weaker, so the body's not receiving that, and at the same time we have man-made electrosmog passing through our body probably 24-7. You can't really exist, I think anywhere on the planet actually, they know the whole field, the whole planet is covered by electrosmog. And so when that passes through the body, the cells, it confuses them and it, it, it interferes with their ability to communicate and to heal illness and disease in the body, basically. So electrosmog is actually the electrical, electrical impulses from cell phones, computers, microwaves, wireless internet, and the list goes on and on. But we're, as he was saying, bombarded with those things, and so this helps to clear yeah. those negative energy. I know traumatic brain injury is one that you've talked about. I work a lot with traumatic brain injury in my practice. Yeah, well I have a lot of athletes, so we're dealing with concussions a lot. And so we put them on the whole body mat for usually 8 to 16 minutes. And then we use this little device here. This is called a probe. And this allows you to sort of almost like a laser beam focus the energy right to a specific spot. So for headaches and tra traumatic brain injury, along the carotid artery on each side for 8 to 16 minutes total. And usually we find a person comes in maybe two to four days in a row and that's it. And we, we see a real acceleration of the brain healing from the damage from a concussion or a TBI. One thing um, that I do like to tell patients is that this is something you need to use quite frequently um, when you're having an acute thing going on. Um, can you talk a little bit about an acute injury? Yeah, for some acute injuries, we can literally just work on someone two times. Uh, but if someone's had a back pain for maybe years, uh, it might take maybe a week or two. So it's not a huge amount of time, but acute injuries, if you get it the day of the injury, we've seen sprained ankles heal in two or three days. Mm -hmm. Yeah, my husband just sprained his wrist and possibly broke a, a bone in his hand, and he's been using the probe on his hand, and he's noticed decrease in swelling and decrease in pain without using any pain medication. Yeah, and the very first pulse energy device that the FDA approved was for broken bones that didn't heal. Mm -hmm. One thing I didn't realize, if you break a bone in your body and it doesn't heal, amputation is the typical outcome. You can't walk around on a leg that has a bone that's mm -hmm. not. So pulsed energy devices, there's a ton of science for that. It's been around for 30 years. Doctors would know about that. So they, they attach a little device that helps the bone heal mm -hmm. the, to mend back. Mm -hmm. So you yeah. talked about research. Has this been researched? This is one of the things that doctors are always surprised at when we show them all the research from places like PubMed. Uh, they're stunned that they don't know about it because there's... Yeah, there's, I was stunned. Yeah, I mean, mm -hmm. it's been going on for 30 years, major universities from Columbia University, Stanford, University of Washington, they've done research on it, and I would say 95% of the research I've read shows that it's fast, effective, and safe. And so, doctors, like I said, are always stunned when I tell them, well, here, here's a, here's a few hundred research abstracts, read them and tell me what you think, and they're very surprised. Right. Yeah. Are there any things you would not want to use the MRS with? Uh, the main one is you have to be careful with people with epilepsy, mm -hmm. and that's more of a precaution as opposed to, oh, we've had ex bad, ex uh, bad outcomes from that. Mm -hmm. Pregnancy, as a cautionary uh, advice, we say don't use it if you're pregnant, uh, not because there's any research. I know people that have used this during their entire pregnancy with no problems. In fact, they actually report that the babies come out 
kind of better than the first one because again the baby's being enhanced during mm -hmm. gestation as is the mother I Okay, so this is what a person does when they're on the mat. You just lay down on it with your clothes on. You could have your shoes on if you wanted. The energy is going to pass through the entire body. We kind of say that the person is in a cloud of electrons. It usually comes up about this high. So they just stay here for 8 to 16 minutes typically, and their whole body is going to be enhanced. And a lot of times that's enough to take away some little aches and pains. One of the things we get back from people is they sleep so good after being on the mat. They just can't believe it. Okay, so once you get done with the 18, 8 to 16 minutes on the mat, then you might apply the little, little pad device. So this could be used, let's say she was having some problems in her torso. She's got some aches, she's got some sore muscles or something. She could lay it like that. Now let's say she has both some sore hands, she was doing a lot of gardening or something, and she's got some stomach problems. Both areas are being uh, affected by the therapy because again, it's going all directions. Okay, so she's getting both areas, I want to say treated, but treated at the same time. Mm -hmm. Okay, now let's say you get done with this after 8, 16, 24 minutes, and let's say she's got a really specific spot on her neck that's really sore. You could just lay this on the neck, on the side of the neck, or behind the neck, and the energy of it comes out 360 degrees. So this is really good for specific areas, like for joints especially, tennis elbow carpal tunnel, any problems with TMJ, uh, ringing of the ears, eye problems you can use that, sinus problems you use on the side of the nose about four, four to eight minutes on each side and we've had people with sinus problems for ten years and within a week or two it's resolved. So this little thing we can, like I say, we refer to this kind of as the magic wand because this is a really powerful device. It's, it's tightly wound with copper in here and it, it works great on sports injuries and any small aches and pains. And you can kind of demonstrate. So I have Ted um, laying on the mat, the MRS 2000, with the sound and light relaxation system. And as you can see, it's a set of goggles and a set of earphones. What it's doing right now for him is the mat is on. I have it on sensitive and at the same time the goggles are flashing certain lights and the earphones are playing certain tones. So what that's doing is it's uh, improving, improving cerebral blood flow, it's also improving neurotransmitter function of the brain, and it is stimulating certain um, brain waves. So you have four main brain waves, uh, beta, alpha, theta, and delta, to use one um, for an example, delta is the brain wave that we use when we are in REM sleep, so it helps with deep sleep. And if I have a patient who has insomnia or sleeping issues, what I do is I put them on the pad and then I set the SLRS for the delta waves. And what it does is it flashes those certain frequencies and plays those tones for that, that wave of the brain. And so eventually it can help the person to get better uh, sleep. We've also used this uh, by hooking, you can hook your iPod into the back of the machine and instead of listening to the tones, you can listen to your own music through the headphones. And we've had a lot of feedback on that, that it's, it's pretty fun uh, because the headphones are so clear and you get the uh, resonance of the music with the flashing lights. And so my patients really enjoy the SLRS because it helps their treatment on the mat go by faster. And as they call it, the sound and light show, gives them something to um, really relax into and helps the brain overall.